Hey chickies! Before we start off this video, I want to apologize for my appearance. I literally just walked in the door from school and my hair, I'm having a bad hair day because it's like kind of greasy and I didn't really do much to my hair and I kind of just put powder on my face and started filming this video so try to ignore my appearance. But today I'm going to be doing a video that was requested by a lot of you chickies and that is what is in my backpack. Now a lot of you wanted me to do this before school started but I wanted to avoid doing it before school started that way I could give you guys like a legitimate interpretation of what is in my backpack. I've been back at school now for six days and I got home and I have my backpack right there so I'm just gonna show you guys what is inside of it. Now I'm telling you right now I did not add anything or take anything out since I got home from school so this is a completely real video of what's in my backpack and I am dead serious when I say I just walked in the door from school. Alright so enough with the blabber let's get started. Okay to start off with what my backpack looks like it is this brown leather bag and I got it from Tilly's. It's not real leather, at least I don't think it is. But basically it has two pockets right here. It has a cell phone pocket and it's really cute. It has buckles on it. Also sorry if you hear some noise in the background, my neighbor is mowing his lawn and my dog is barking. So um, yeah. But yeah, like I said, this is what the backpack looks like. This is the back of it if you guys are wondering. It's just kind of plain and brown, but I like it a lot. Okay, so now we are going to move on to what is in the actual backpack. Alright, so first I'm going to start off with these three pockets. So in the first pocket I have some gum and this is just tried and spearmint and it came with 40 pieces and I think I'm already down to 20. Seriously, I chew gum so much in school and also a lot of my friends are always asking me for gum. So I always keep a pack of gum in my backpack. And then also in that same pocket I actually have my phone charger because during my lunch period I like to charge my phone because my phone dies really, really quickly. So it's always nice to have my charger and be able to charge it. All right, in the middle pocket, there's actually nothing in here. I use the middle pocket that way when I'm in class, I can just slip my phone in it and then slip it out whenever I need it. And then the last pocket in the front, I have this little quilted bag type of thing. And basically in here, all I have in here is just panty liners, pads and some tampons because you never know when you're going to get your period and plus if you already do have your period it's always good to have that stuff with you. Okay so now we are going to move on to what is in the actual main part of the backpack. Alright so to start off I have my calculator for trigonometry in here. It is a TI-83+. plus. If you guys were wondering, I mean, there's nothing too special about it, it's just for a trig. Did you guys just see that my, like, thing fell? My suspender thing fell. Alright, so next I have my pencil case, and this is one of the zip-up pencil cases. I believe this was called, oh, it's called Zip It, my bad. But basically inside of here, I just have my pens and pencils, and I have a highlighter in here. So yeah, there's nothing too really exciting about that. And then I have this little baggie, and this little baggie, if you guys don't know, is my girl pack, and if you guys want to figure out how to make your own girl pack for school, the link to the video will be below, because I did make a video showing what is in it. So basically in here, all I have is some hand sanitizer, I have a mini brush, I have a little sponge to touch up my makeup, um, I have a mirror, a clip, I have some Tic Tacs, I have a Tide to Go pen, some lip balm, and then just like a couple other shenanigans and stuff like Midol and all that stuff. But like I said, link below to make your own girl pack if you want to watch the video on making it. I think it's very convenient for a lot of girls. Alright, so moving on to the rest of the stuff that's in the bag. First, I have my agenda book in here, and I'm not going to show you the front of it because it does have my school name on it. However, the back right here is just a bell schedule, and it just tells you like my times and stuff like that, what time the periods start and what time the periods end. And then right here, I always keep a spare pen, and this is actually one I got from IMAX, and it's from the Sigma booth. If you open up my agenda book, the first thing you see is my schedule, but once again, I'm not going to show you guys that because that also has my school name on it. However, this is my planner. This is basically what we keep our school work on and stuff like that. Like, as you guys can see, today is Tuesday, so I still have to do a bunch of stuff. And that was from yesterday, so yeah, this is how I keep track of my homework. The next thing in here is this spiral notebook, and it's very pretty. It's by Five Star. Yeah. It's only one subject, but I use it for global because I really don't take a lot of notes in global. But it just has like the little folder thing here, and then these are my notes so far. If you guys were curious, I mean, it's just like, I don't know, I did take a couple pages of notes and stuff, but um, yeah. The next thing in here is my folder for my global class, and it's just white, and it's from 5 star. And here I just have stuff like my current events homework, a map, and like, I don't know, just 
random stuff I get from class. And then in here I have this folder, and this folder is my take home folder, and I use this for all of my homework. Since English is my last class of the day, I have my English binder in here, and honestly I do not need this with me. I could have put this in my locker, but if I put this in my locker then I would have missed my bus because they don't really give you much time in between. So yeah, I basically have my English binder here, and yes, I did design this cover and stuff of that. If you guys were running very Tumblr, I put a picture on my Instagram of it. A lot of you wanted to know how to do this because a lot of you liked it and wanted a DIY. I don't think I'm gonna do a DIY on it because it's very simple. All I did is I pulled up pages, or for you guys, it might be Microsoft Word, depending if you use a Mac or a PC. And then basically, I just took some pictures off of my Tumblr account, and my Tumblr link will be below if you guys want to check it out. And yeah, so basically, I just took some pictures off of Tumblr, pasted them, resized them and stuff and then I typed out English right there and that's about it so that is all for what is in my backpack I hope you guys enjoyed this is kind of a quick video and stuff like that I hope you guys enjoyed it though because it was very requested and of course more videos to come and yeah so I will see you guys in the next video bye bye chickies Mwah.